Thank you for tuning in to another edition of the Volcker Report. This report is for Thursday, June the 2nd, 2016. This is a quick video looking at Bitcoin due to overwhelming requests. I have ventured out to start covering Bitcoin now since people want to know uh, more about cryptocurrencies and uh, how those analysis fare as well. As you can see, this market has been in a very powerful uptrend, hence the bull, the green bull at the bottom right hand corner. And you can see bull market spelled out here. It's in green. Market is uptrending. You see long term trend line support, this green line here, and the shorter term uh, trend line uh, right here and here and you can see that the market is quite powerful right now so this market's doing quite well for itself the only thing is it's really not a tradable entity if we were to break it down it's, it's, it just isn't it's not a tradable entity per se um, so we have to take all things into consideration when we're looking at this particular market um, this would be one of those situations where you're just looking for entry points to buy or entry points to sell, to get out of something. You know, take the profit and run per se. So it's like a long only type of a strategy. And if we go back here, you can look and you can see this market has had quite a bit of volatility in it. Uh, on this bar in particular, we went from 3.2207 to 4.9240, so that's quite a move. This market is reminiscent of the early days of Globex back in the late 90s, and what happened was back then we had daily uh, ranges in the uh, in the Nasdaq futures of 200 points, 100 points in the uh, S&P and the Dow also had ranges of about 600 points alright this was normal this was normal daily volatility alright it was quite the roller coaster and that's pretty much what you're seeing here in this environment um, as you can see uh, going back here take a look at this one this was uh, June the week of June the 8th of 2014 where this market traded up to 675.91 and by January the 18th of 2015 the market was trading down to 170.21 so that is an enormous move that is monstrous and like I said you can't really trade this like you can any other instrument like stocks and forex and, and futures because you can't sell short you can only buy it you can only go long so you basically if you bought up in here you would have been looking to get out and take profit somewhere in here and hopefully you bought way back here and not up in here or you took a loss you took a big loss uh, so if you waited you would have been able to get back along this market up in here you would have been able to get back along up in here you could have bought here and then you could have held for a few months market would have got up to 313 and you waited a few more months here the market sold off some more and gave you another entry point here all right so there are times where you can buy Bitcoin the last entry was powerful. Your last opportunity to buy this early was at um, was at 283.55, okay, and it hasn't looked back since. And now here we are trading at you know the 530s, all right, and that's that's pretty powerful. So where are we now? Well, right now, Bitcoin remains well supported at uh, 435.62. So it's well supported up here. It can it, it can sustain pullbacks to the 
Uh, first trend line support here, 491.57, and even here to the intermediate of 457.93, and even way down here at the long-term trend line support of 373.79, before even getting into the Kumo cloud down in here in the 300s. So this market is well supported. Um, right now, there's just no no buying opportunity you missed it you have to wait for the next pullback but it is very strong and it, it remains well supported right now so I will do my best to incorporate more of these videos uh, as we move on every day and we'll see uh, see what comes of it see what kind of interest there is if there's interest in it then I'll, I'll keep doing them if not it will simply fade away uh, if it's not worth the time and no one cares about the analysis because there's no one operating in it. All right, so that's it for now. Uh, that's our Bitcoin analysis and uh, due to popular demand. So there you, there you have it. And remember, bulls make money, bears make money, but pigs get slaughtered. Remember to take what you can, give nothing back.